Hey folks, Nintendo here. Today we're going over some creative ways to stash your items, which may be less likely to be found. Hidden stashes are one of the more stealthy ways to store your items. An alternative title to this video could be where to find hidden stashes, so keep that in mind and plan accordingly. A few tips to think about when making a stash. Consider where players typically travel, common pathing, and places people usually loot. After making a buried stash, try to view it from a couple different angles and make sure it's not sticking out in obvious ways. Don't put all your good stuff in one stash, spread out your loot in more than one stash. Make sure you can find your stash again after you've placed it. Take a screenshot, line it up with another landmark, or place a marker on an online map such as I Survive. No spot is 100% safe, but some spots are better than others. First up, we have stashing crates in bodies of water. You can actually walk pretty far into ponds and drop a crate. That crate will not be visible from a distance, and there's no dirt pile to find either. Simply walk as far as you can before it makes your character swim. Drop the crate, and whenever you want to go back and check on it, simply walk up to it. Graveyards can also be another place to put a hidden stash that will not leave behind a dirt pile. Place the crate directly on top of the grave and then bury it. No dirt left behind. Whenever you're ready, go ahead and dig it back up. Keep in mind, although it works on this style of grave, some other graves may not work out the same. This next one is more of a meme, but I just wanted to show that you technically can place a wooden crate inside of an outhouse. Probably not the best place for one, but it is possible. It might be a good spot for loot that's not important, like farming materials. Talking about farming, you can place a buried stash inside of a greenhouse plot, bury your stash in one of the corners, it will blend in well and not be completely obvious. You can take it a step further by making a garden plot inside. This garden plot will actually cover the buried stash and it will be harder for someone to target. In a similar fashion, you can make a garden plot and then place a buried stash inside. Again, this is for less valuable items, I just wanted to show you that it is possible. Make a garden plot, and then bury your crate inside. You won't be able to see the dirt pile, and it will be totally hidden from a quick glance. You can also bury stashes on these dirt piles often found near barns. Burying your crate here will make it very hard to see from a distance. The average person walking by would likely not see it very well. Your luck may vary on this one. Here is another completely stealthy one. Sandboxes can make for great hidden stashes. Place the crate in the corner and then go ahead and bury it. You'll notice after burying it that there is no dirt pile to give the location away. This is great for medium tier loot to come back to after a death and grab a quick handgun and some ammo from. Lastly, we have one of the most stealthy ways to make a buried stash. Underneath trees and bushes. With trees, First, I like to place a couple items around the tree so I know where the middle is. Chop down the tree. Then use the items you placed to decide where the crate should go. You want to try to aim for the middle where the trunk was. After the server resets, the tree will respawn and your buried stash will be under it. To get your loot back, you'll have to chop the tree down again. So anyone trying to find your stash, first they'll have a very hard time noticing the dirt pile, and then if they do find it, they'll have to chop the tree down to get to it. Alright, leave a comment down below and let me know what you think, or if I'm missing something. Check the video on the left and learn more about stashes. Catch me live on Twitch by following the link below. Subscribe to the channel and snipe the like button. Thank you and have an awesome day. Peace.